Hey guys, we're out here at the property. Um, just doing some kind of cleanup work in the forest. We had a ton of trees come down. We had a big windstorm maybe two months ago. So we have a ton of big old trees that have come down. So we've decided to kind of put those to use. And uh, we have another one right here. Kind of the top of a tree came down and kind of got the branches all cleaned off <clears throat> and we got the logs cleaned up so what we decided to do is uh, kind of put these logs to, to use and set up a nice little camping spot or kind of a bushcraft slash just camping relaxing spot out here at the uh, property so have a little nice fire ring made here um, and we're gonna set up a little bench here with the, some of the logs that came down. Eugene's gonna try to move this thing. All right, bro. Need some deadlifting for us here. I can do a deadlift. All right, things, let's this good. What is this called? Cambering? Caber? No. Caber toss? No. There we go. So we've given up on the camber toss or whatever it is. I'm gonna try to roll this thing. All right. On three. We can get it over there. We go. Hold on. Slowly. Yeah, I think it's heavy, but it should make a nice seat when we once we get it over there. I think it'll be really comfy, stable, sturdy thing. Get it on these logs. Gotta clean that one up still. All right, so we've got the big old log. In position to put on the smaller logs. I'm not sure terminology for all this is, but it should be nice. Look at that fireplace and a nice log to sit on for starters. And at some point, we have to burn an inaugural fire in this fire pit. See how my little system works with a little air intake there in a kind of a heat shield rock. So, yeah, we're well, gonna need to clean this tree out, by the way. Because there are ticks, the ticks are out in the northwest. Yeah. Already, I don't know about other parts of the country. We were here just a couple days ago, got two ticks on me. Yeah, I'm One sure. One lasted for three days and on my clothing and then came out today. So that was interesting. Yeah. It's hiding somewhere. <clears throat> okay, I think there's a good spot here. Okay, so we've gotten the big cross log or whatever onto the supports there. It's looking good. Yeah, we clean this one off. Looks really nice. Hopefully, once it kind of dries up, we'll clean out that hole, debark the whole thing, and then it looks like a nice campsite. We could actually eventually cut like a whole layer off of this, like a, a half circle. Yeah. Not not too thick. Maybe we can do that once we get our. Alaskan chainsaw mill. <laughs> no, we're not getting one of those. <laughs> I'll just do it myself. So yeah, it's nice, huh? Putting the uh, little tools to use. This thing's doing really well. It's like a antique little no-name. Well, it has a name, but it's kind of cool. A little hatchet. That I always have with me. So I'm putting the big old Grand Force Brooks American Felling Axe. To use as well. Yeah, it's really working, working really well. Yeah. <clears throat> and this thing right here, which is my lemming axe, which is a lakeside axe. Check it out. That's just like a. Uses quite a bit in the woods. And this thing. This is like a old little hatchet we had forever, and I put a new handle on there. Out of oak, curled oak. Looks pretty cool. Anyways, so yeah, there's our progress for today. So, do you think people will like these videos? A little campsites, maybe? Well, people, let us know, dear viewers. Um, yeah, let us know what you think about these videos. If you want to see more of these bushcrafting videos, we do, we we've started going out a lot more bushcrafting lately. But we'll be back to the backpacking. Hmm. 
<laughs> That's right. Yes. Anyways, it should be nice. We gotta make a campfire at some point. All right, guys, that's kind of it for today for our work. Um, so we'll end the thing right here. Um, yeah, like we said, if you liked it, give us a thumbs up or just leave your comments below. Always appreciate that. And uh, tell us what you think about our campsite and what we could do here. And as always, praise God. See you guys in the next one. Amen. Bye.